Okay, so it's towards the end of day six on the Uberman sleep cycle, and I've achieved REM sleep. Ah, yeah! Fantastic. And it's, it's been a... I definitely didn't expect it, because this morning, again, I overslept. Um, it was just the sleep pressure or whatever is just built up so high that I got my five o'clock nap, and just out of sheer determination, I got up. But I was just feeling so crummy and just way down. I'm like, man, I'm going to take another nap just to kind of boost me because this is killing me. So I, I took one at 7. Um, I was going to have one at 7 as well as one at 9, like normal. But the 7 one, I, uh, you know, you can guess what happened. I woke up and it was 8.30. And I'm like, oh, not again. So this is like four or five consecutive days that I've slept in on. And the whole point of the Ubermoon sleep cycle is to starve yourself of, you know, those chunks of sleep where you would naturally get REM sleep anyway. Um, so I was kind of like, oh, I've done six days and it's been really hard. Um, so I was just wondering, has it all been for nothing? And then during today, so I slept in the morning. Um, I didn't take my nine o'clock nap because I woke up half an hour before I would have had to take it anyway. So I kind of skipped that. Um... When it came to one, I um, I actually went to Worcester to uh, pick up my iPhone, um, and it took longer than I expected. So I was in there past one, kind of got back, had my nap at three, um, and then I had another nap. So I was like, oh, I'm just going to skip one of the naps. So instead of three throughout today, I've had kind of uh, two. So I had one at three and one at uh, about uh, 8.30, I think. Yeah, 8.30. And, um, on the latest one, um, I had REM sleep, as in I dreamed. I freaking dreamed! And I woke up in a panic, because it felt so long that, you know, it felt easily like an hour and a half. And, um, my brother came in, he was like, poked me, and I'm like, oh no, I've done it again! And he's like, hmm? And then my alarm goes off, and I'm like, oh? So, uh... So yeah, um, I had REM sleep and I really had a really weird, really weird, messy, bizarre dream. It was more of a nightmare. Um, it was really frantic and nasty, and I barely remember it. The, um, the the details of my dream that I remember, my REM sleep dream. Um, I've been playing a lot of Call of Duty, and what happened in my dream was I was kind of playing it, but I was more kind of the soldier or a person. And I was kind of in the background or whatever, and I'd see a bunch of people, as in soldiers, run past me of the other team, of the enemy. And I'd be like, oh, and I'd run up stealth, stealth up behind them, right? <laughs> and, and I'd go, <laughs> this is so nerdy, but I'd go to do my melee attack, as in knife them. Um, and I kind of had my head clicking the, uh, the R3 button on the PS controller. So I run up behind them, and I want to stab them, and I'm doing it. And I've come up behind them perfectly, and it's not happening. And I'm just absolute horror is I cannot stop. And then they turn around, and they see me, and then they either get me or they shoot me. And from what I remember my dream, this was just on loop. <laughs> and so, like I just keep running up to people like, ah, and just frantically trying to get them, but unable to do it. And then they all end up getting me. So what do you think of that, Freud? <laughs> mm, yeah. Anyway, so, so yeah, so anyway, I feel really great. Um, I felt so refreshed. Um, it's definitely the best nap I've had throughout the whole cycle. Um, I feel so refreshed, such a difference. I, like, my body's actually gotten some of what it actually needs. So, that's fantastic. Um, I'd say really, mainly just make a video out of excitement. In celebration, I'm wearing a complete velour outfit. <laughs> This is like a 80s velour thing that I've had in my wardrobe forever. And I'm also wearing my gangster Adidas tracky pants, which are also velour. It's all about retro comfort. So, yeah. Um, I think that's it. Love ya!